Hi guys, so my mood has been way boosted the last couple days and I know that has to do with me exercising, which is great. I've been cycling for 30 minutes and um, I've been feeling it. <laughs> the quads are kind of hurting, the cardio is kind of a lot worse than I thought. But instead of getting discouraged, I really want to keep building it up because my goal is to be able to cycle 100k consistently all in one shot um, with my boyfriend by the end of summer. So last summer I managed to do a 60k without any prior training, which was quite impressive for me. So I figure if I stick to this, I keep my training regimen going, I eat properly, then I will be able to reach that goal. So personally, I've noticed it's been boosting my mood incredibly. Um, I've also accepted the fact that in terms of diet, I enjoy junk food and I will do once a week a snack night when I'll go out and get whatever I'm craving in that moment but the rest of the week try and eat pretty clean. I would allow myself maybe one day to go out for dinner because that's inevitable most weeks. You know, you'll have a friend who wants to go for dinner, you'll have a craving for Thai Express or whatever. You know, I think you have to leave that part open so that, you know, you'll be able to um, stick to your plans overall. And um, one of my big indulgences is tea, so that's a pretty healthy thing. I have a whole video about it. And I just bought myself a new one, Tetley Pina Colada, and it is amazing. It's an herbal tea as well, so you can drink it at night. And my boyfriend just got me an early birthday gift, an Adventure Time mug, so I am very happy. I love that show. So I've been sipping tea out of here. Um, and so trying to just consume more fluids, you know, more, sounds really weird, more water, more tea, uh, keep my hydration good, especially since I'm exercising a bit more, trying to eat a lot more fruits, vegetables. I've been craving fruit a lot, so sometimes I'll go and buy the pre-cut fruit, uh, because it motivates me to eat it, since it's already ready like that, and it has pineapple mix, let's say, melon, grapes, just a bunch of different things that are really delicious. And, um... I've also been getting outside more because there have been pockets of sunshine, so just trying to get a little more light on the brain. Vitamin D is so important if you are dealing with low moods, depression. It helps boost up your mood, most definitely. So I got out there and I was reading um, my boyfriend's book, Bike Your Butt Off, and um, just kind of learning how to get starting with, with my cycling routine, um, especially on my own. I don't feel confident enough getting out and doing all the cycling on main streets, maybe eventually I'll build myself up, but I think that's also part of the social anxiety and feeling like I'm not doing things right and I don't want to get out there with low confidence because that can be very dangerous on the road. So just to be able to train indoors for now is very beneficial for me. So I'm really happy about that and I do know that exercise um, for those who are let's say mildly or moderately depressed can act just as effectively as um, an antidepressant. It's been scientifically proven. So I'm really banking on that. I do believe it's true. Um, you get so many feel-good endorphins afterwards, and I find it's extremely beneficial. So that, paired with the healthy diet, and then consuming lots of tea, lots of water, getting adequate sleep, has been working so well for me. So I'll keep you guys updated on the journey. If anyone else wants to uh, comment in on if they're going through anything similar, if they have any fitness goals themselves, that would be amazing because I really like, you know, having that, that tight-knitness with people so you're able to relate and uh, talk about your own experiences. And um, on a very random side note, I noticed that some people from Sweden are watching my videos and that just excites me. I feel like I'm just, I should be from Sweden. I don't know. I'm not, but I should be. <laughs> It was very random. I think these are the endorphins talking, so I'm gonna go. But um, thanks for listening, guys, and please feel free to subscribe. And uh, I'll keep you guys always updated on my nutrition and um, my fitness. All right, thanks, guys. Bye.